Now, Channel 3, Early Warning Weather. Hi everybody, good afternoon. Meteorologist Lauren Richardson here on this Tuesday and it really is a nice afternoon to get outside. It's going to be breezy. We're going to be dry once again and we'll see some clouds building through this afternoon. But let's talk about tomorrow too. We do have this area uh, of low pressure. I'm going to show you on the satellite radar to the east of us and you can actually see it's to the south of us as well. And that is expected to impact us in some way tomorrow. It's still questionable about how much rain we are expecting to get, but eastern Connecticut has the great this chance to see some showers and they are much needed for our state. All right, here's a look in Old Saybrook uh, right now this afternoon. You can actually see a lot of cloud cover out there, so it depends where you are, but you might be seeing some sunshine and it's once again going to be nice this afternoon. Now we do have the chance for some showers tomorrow. Otherwise, we will be partly sunny and then we've got a warming trend as we head into the weekend. So we're looking at temperatures that are going to get into the low 90s potentially in some spots inland. Here's a look at our future cast. So through this afternoon. Yes, you can see those clouds building and into this evening we're going to be mostly cloudy. Then we wake up tomorrow morning. We do have the chance for some showers in eastern Connecticut. So just a heads up about that. And then as we head towards the afternoon too, looks like this system actually wraps to the north and around us. Uh, so we're not expecting a lot of beneficial rain, but we could see some more showers through the afternoon as well and even in some areas of northern Connecticut. Now moving into Thursday, you can actually see we're going to be dry once again and mostly sunny after as that center uh, pulls to the northeast of us. So uh, as we head through the day on Thursday, sunshine will be bright through the afternoon and then the same thing into Friday. We'll be seeing mostly sunny skies. Now once again, we really do need the rain. Uh, we're either in a severe to moderate drought for a lot of the entire state. You can actually see we're in a severe drought for areas of Litchfield County as well as Tolland and Wyndham and New London County and even some Middlesex County as well. So our early warning pinpoint Doppler right now scanning once again dry conditions. Uh, you could see some clouds out there in New London as well. Maybe some blue sky, more blue skies over here in Waterbury. 76 degrees. It is breezy out there too with a northeast wind coming in. So temperatures anywhere from 78 to 82 degrees, even 84 degrees. We're warming up pretty nicely on this Tuesday afternoon. Those dew points are feeling very comfortable out there. And here's a look at those wind speeds too. Anywhere really from 7 to 16 miles per hour. That's a sustained wind once again coming in from the northeast. So today it's going to be maybe up to 84 degrees in the Hartford area, 80 for tomorrow. Once again, with that chance for some showers, I don't think we're expecting a lot of precipitation from the system. We'll keep you posted 83 on Thursday, 88 on Friday. Then we've got a warming trend heading into the weekend, so it's definitely going to feel uh, a little bit hotter. We could even feel muggy too on Saturday with a high temperature of 90 degrees, 91 on Sunday, and then we do have another chance for some rainfall Monday afternoon and evening with temperatures back in the 80s. We will be keeping you posted on that. Kara.